Headlines coming in with the music, then they transition to the hello. After that, the officer shooting. That would be a great story to put there because it has. Oh, hey there. I wasn't expecting you to pop up, but since you made an appearance here, why don't I tell you what I've been up to, what I'm doing right here? I'm looking over the rundown for the newscast of this week as I am the producer. Now, the producer is the most important job in journalism. The producer uh, decides what stories will come first, what stories will come second, which stories will come last. The producer decides the layout of the stories. And it draws back to what we talked about a couple weeks ago, news values. News values varies if the story is happening locally, if the story is happening about someone that you know, a celebrity or a well-known politician. A producer has to figure out what stories flow best and arrange them in the specific order. A good producer has a variety of stories that include a VO SOT, a VO, or a package. It's extremely important to communicate with your team as a producer to have a clear understanding of what content will be aired. Timing is a big factor as well. Stories should be aligned properly so scripts will be read within the proper time frame. So with that being said, let's take a look at this rundown that I've created, um, that I've looked over. I've looked at the page, those are the page numbers. This is the story slug, what the title will be, the anchor that will be doing the story, who will be talking about it, how many people will be on camera? Will there be a reporter and an anchor? Or how does that, how many people are gonna be on cam? The lower thirds are the breakdown of where the story may happen, who was involved in it. And right here, we have the different type of video it might be. Is it a package? Is it a over the shoulder? Is it a VO? The writer, the person who wrote the script, that's very important. We need to know who wrote it. And lastly, we have the time. Well, that's going to do it for us today. For Eagle News, I'm Tyra Redmond reporting live from the control room.